just going to show this, and I'm going to show one more move after this, and we'll do breaks, and I'll have everyone get through their notes. Uh, so I've already gotten to here. I've gotten this head pulled down. I'm completely missing it. What I want to do is I want to put his head right underneath my uh, dart, that little bone right there uh, in between your chest plate. I'm going to keep the back of the head on there, and I'm going to keep locking here until I can get to something and pull him down, okay? As soon as I got him pulled down, I'm going to take this arm, and I'm going to swing it up to here, okay? Now, this is traditional cow catcher territory where everybody tries to muscle and rip the guy over. We're not going to do that. We're going to rotate what I call holster to holster. This is my gun holster, okay, on each side. I'm a black hat cowboy, so I carry two guns. So I'm going to rotate my, my left, the underhook holster towards his holster with his head turned. I don't need to actually twist his, rip his body over. Just our holster is spinning. So naturally, see how quick that tap came? I'm not pulling his head. I'm not forcing it over. I'm just trying to go holster to holster. So when I covered, the moment I pulled him a little bit, I got the post, I knocked, and I came. From there, I'm going to shoot my holster to his holster with that chin wrench. He's going to rotate. And if he doesn't give up the pen, we'll just break his neck. We'll, okay, we'll get out of there quick enough. I'm, I'm not going to waste all my energy. So. Let's go play with that, but don't break your partner's neck. <laughs> <laughs> you need it for the next move. One, two.